What's up, yo? Uh, just watch Raw. Uh, it's pretty good. Um, reaction to Raw? Uh, well, Triple H fought for the first time in like three years on Raw. He uh, faced Dolph Ziggler. Uh, it was an okay match. Was, you know, uh, Triple H and Dean Ambrose. Uh, looks like that little rivalry is over. That was a, a great match at Roadblock. Everyone knew Triple H was going to win, but still, uh, shocking, you know, Dean Ambrose pinned him, but his feet were under the ropes. That was kind of cool. But, anyways, Triple H beat Ziggler, and, uh, Roman Reigns came back. Whoa, yay. Came back and, uh, annihilated. Triple H, pretty good. Uh, it's cool, I guess. I don't... Good for him on coming back. Uh, Dean Ambrose confronted, uh, Brock Lesnar and Paul Heyman. Uh, he had a crowbar, crowbar with him and Brock backed off, uh, Dean Bruce is crazy, obviously. Lunatic, whatever. Um, Sami Zayn uh, wrestled, finally. Uh, beat The Miz. So that was, that was cool, I guess. Uh, a lot of other mid-matches that were okay. Eh. Nap-worthy. Um, but at the end, I was like, okay. Dean's already performed, Triple H, from the right. It's like, what's, it must be Vince McMahon, of course. 11 o'clock hits, Vince McMahon comes out, blah, blah, blah. Undertaker comes out, and uh, Vince is like, don't you ever touch me again. Undertaker takes off his jacket. As Susie's about to talk, Shane McMahon's music hits. He comes out, so... Vince, The Undertaker, Shane McMahon, all in wondering about time. That is pretty sweet to see. But it's hard. It's still confusing. Like, who do? Who am I supposed to cheer? Like, I like The Undertaker. You know, it's childhood hero. And then, but he's a heel? He's an enemy? Like, because we want Shane to win. We want him to have Raw. It's weird. And... Shane kind of brought that up. Uh, he's talking about how he's going to beat The Undertaker. And The Undertaker's like, man, it doesn't matter. You're not going to beat me. And then Shane McMahon's like, why am I, you know, why am I fighting you? Why you? Like, uh, you're like a puppet. You're, uh, you're Vince McMahon's bitch. And as soon as he said that, The Undertaker was like, ha. Went to go choke slam, slam him. Uh, Shane McMahon counted it, started punching uh, Taker, and Taker threw him in the ropes, went to punch him, missed, and then uh, Shane ducked and kind of like, you know, got in position. Vince pushed him into the Undertaker. Undertaker choke slams him, but the, and Vince is all cheering and happy. Undertaker just looks at Vince and goes to hit him, and Vince gets out of the ring. So, Shane still looks a little awkward when he is wrestling, like, his punches and stuff. Hopefully he gets it together before WrestleMania. I'd prefer not to watch his little dances. Usually they're cool, but it's just, it looks awkward. So, I still have no idea what, how to cheer or what to, I don't know. Uh, I just hope the match is good and. There's, you know, something shocking. I don't know if John Cena or someone's going to come out or I don't, I can't see Shane McMahon and Taker and Hell in a Cell at WrestleMania. Even in the old days, you know, I'm sure they in the old days, it probably would have been a decent match. I don't know about WrestleMania, but, you know, Shane McMahon's had some great matches. Uh, you know, Kurt Angle at King of the Ring, that's one that really jumps in my mind, you know, they just, they went all out, yeah, the fact that they even finished the match is kind of shocking, but, I mean, he could put on a good match, but the Undertaker at WrestleMania, Hell in a Cell, you know, 
because Taker doesn't wrestle those kind of Shane McMahon matches. So, I don't know, it's confusing. Uh, it was a good Raw. It was awesome seeing uh, Taker and Shane finally um, confront each other. Uh, Shane brought up a good point why, why you know, he's confused on why Taker's in this match or on wrestling for Vince McMahon. And Taker's just kind of, I don't know why he's doing it. <laughs> it just makes no sense. Like, Taker's in the middle, so, like, we cheer for him, but we we don't. And then Shane, you have to cheer for Shane. And then Vince is like, we don't like Vince. And then got Taker's in the middle, and then Shane's the person we cheer for. Okay, it's just weird. I know there's going to be something more to it. It keeps finally progressing each week. So, I don't know. I mean, we've got, what? Three weeks left to WrestleMania, so it, it's exciting. It's awesome. I uh, can't wait. Uh, Roman Reigns is back. Like I said, I don't really, I don't care. Uh, he's gonna win at WrestleMania. That's predictable. But I do think, for me at least, the big story is uh, Shane McMahon Taker thing. Uh, I know there's gonna be some kind of surprise, you know, to it. So keep me on my toes. Good Raw, uh, worth watching the highlights when that comes out tomorrow or whenever on YouTube, so thanks for watching, post your opinions, comments below, till next time.